Okay, name is Arnold. We're having a real men's talk about real issues affecting men. We're out here in the in the nature in nature. We've come up about maybe I don't know maybe 200 feet, 250 feet. It's good. I wish our fathers were with us. <laughs> It'd be a good exercise. But we're having a great talk to help us to grow as men uh, in the Lord. So thank you. Echo, 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 Jones, how are you doing? I'm good, bro. How is the weather? Damn. Damn. I love this environment so natural. So I want to ask you what exactly we'll be doing here today. So Ziggy. Yeah, so... Tell uh, us something. It's more like a, a church program. Okay. So uh, the men's fellowship in my church. Mm -hmm. We just decided that uh, since the... The summer getting to fall is, is it's almost ending. Uh, we we are here to just sit down and talk, right? Just just discuss things that are related to men, right? Like business, like family life, and all those kind of things, and and also get to know each other more, right? So I thought that once you are here, Charlie, you'll be real brother. So. Okay. Let's let's come and sit around and listen to some of these business people, you know, who have been here for like 30, 25 years. Wow. They owe some into real estate, banking, insurance, and, and the like. So we are just here to listen to them and, you know, do some chops as well. Yeah! <laughs> yeah. Hey, can we all come in? Yeah. Where did you get hey what's good everybody thank you very much for checking me i'm very happy being here today because i'm lucky to be amongst uh very intelligent very clever uh deep guys here in calgary canada so uh like you saw in the first um scene uh jones my friend who is now living here invited me over to uh, join the men's fellowship because today they wanted to do hiking and honestly this is my first time this is my very first time I am having this kind of uh, event I mean back in Ghana yes you could have guys you know moving around doing what we have to do basically go out to chill drink and stuff like that but not really to sit and really talk about our spirituality our you know um, I mean a lot of things that has to do with men you know grooming yourself as a man so I, I'm, I'm, I'm very glad that Jones brought me up here I've really learned a lot having a discussion with the men over there and it's so beautiful so uh, basically this video is just to show you what I did today uh, they said it's Thanksgiving long weekend right so we just came out here to hike it was beautiful I mean, you know, through the mountains, you know, I mean, it's so, it's so nice. So I want to say uh, big ups to all the guys who uh, had a conversation with, who, they were, and they were all like friendly. I mean, I didn't see anybody frowning. Everybody was like, cool. Hey, hello. Nice to meet you. I'm, a, I'm this, I'm this, I'm a call, you know, that kind of thing. So um, this video is just to show you that there's a lot we can do together as men when we sit and then, you know, talk about the things that will really put us in in ship so this video is basically to show you what happened here and it was nice meeting all of you for me the morning devotion your devotion right yeah by the devotion you can either have a family devotion yeah. one and yeah. you can have your personal devotion as well right so would, would it be good to have both at the same time or just having your family devotion that's good enough right the family devotion is not enough. No. Okay. They all depend. Some some people have a weekly. Yeah. Some okay. people have a daily. But even if you have a daily, you're the one feeding. Yeah. Yeah. Right. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. There needs to be the personal one first. Okay. Like okay. Pastor said, you're the one feeding. Okay. Basically, the source of like, I mean, if you're like for the men, uh, instance, we're the head, right? Mm -hmm. And they're supposed to be. Uh,
looking at it. Yeah, it's <laughs> Does it always have to be like this? How do you get aligned with the facts? Like sometimes I make a comment and my wife is like, no. Um, maybe I say, stop jumping, you're going to get hurt. And she's like, no, she's not going to get hurt. Right? Because she, she knows I know that your, your words are powerful. But sometimes she knows that I, I could also forget it. Yeah, I think what I'll say is, um, uh, we like it. it. If we only do this walk once, we get So, if we only pray on special occasions, <laughs> or read our Bible on special, or just come to church, or just open the Bible, or pray anytime we're coming to church. It does happen. Okay. It does happen for real. People will get married and they realize that okay, it's not what I thought it is, right? But here is the case: you have to try and work it out with a woman. It's So, if you're buying stocks, you see it go up, you will never think it will go down. When you're, when you're, when, when the enthusiasm is there, but you have to have a contrary mind to it. That, okay, when it gets here, I don't care what happens. I'm out. Yeah, that's it. And that's completely contrary to the normal way of doing that. And with business, let's say you have a business. Simple rich. Yeah. Yeah. Start oh, for rich. <laughs> and he's here, and he's here. Because he is coming, he's coming on this year. That, that, that is someone's <laughs> love language, actually. Yes. Someone's love language is buy stuff for me. Yeah. And the more stuff you buy for me, then they know. That's what, that's yeah. what I love and some you. people, some men also get some gratification doing that. They feel good. So in that case, you go to work and make sure you make the bags yes. so that you can take care of that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Spending 10,000, you know, it's expensive it's going for to you. break my bank. Yeah, yeah but, but for, for me, somebody, 10,000 is nothing. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So you have to make sure that you can sustain that for the next year. Yeah. Because <laughs> <laughs> what they see today, they think they need to be They can't do that forever. First, you know, you can't do that forever then. <laughs> you don't have to start what you can continue. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and nobody goes down to new materials. In the Garden of Eden, it was the same thing. So by the order, by God's order, man is always at the top. When a woman becomes a leader in the family, then there is something wrong. The man might not be doing something right. 
Okay. So with women, not necessarily making the woman heads of the family. Or heads of the family. But you also have to share with them. They, sometimes they are very brilliant. They, are, they may not have the business document, but they are brilliant. So they can advise you. And if you take the advice, it will help you. Some will want to push that advice. That is why you have to negotiate with them that ask for this one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so, if I should go, it's, it's to go this way, to go that way. But don't let them take absolute control over all the decisions. So, there are some very brilliant women. They are, they are emotional. Women are very, very emotional. At the point where you have to take a very strong decision, you see that they bring emotion into it and they don't become rational about it. And if you are not careful with business, when you use your emotions, you make a mistake. So you just have to be clear headed, level headed, and take those decisions. So let's listen to them, let's take information from them, but not necessarily put in them. Naturally, I, they have some intuition. So if you check our mothers, we Hello everyone. Yeah, so, thank you all very much for showing up. I know who's the Oh, okay. Hello. Peace out. Peace out. The way that the energy was there. After about two minutes and a half, you almost say, I do I don't know. 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 I do Okay, okay, we have a help here. You have a okay, okay. Yeah, he said we spoke about it. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, 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 Oh, Paul, somebody is going to answer the question for you. Maybe you continue, continue. Someone, someone. Your name, your name. Fred. Someone would like to want maybe a tall lady. Maybe. Yeah. Nobody is watching you. You are your own. You are selling each other. It was it was an amazing time. We really had fun learning from people's experiences. Um, and I think for me, the biggest thing that I took away today was the fact that as a man, you have to make sure that you're making time to feed yourself, to be able to feed your family. And so make time to fellowship. And it's not just morning or evening, it should be all the time and continuous to be able to maintain that leadership role. And, and, and I also learned that I shouldn't be scared of um, connecting to my community. Right because that's where i make that's where i make the most connections and that's where um i could unleash my my generational wealth Great. thank you boss right. you're welcome <laughs> <laughs> right. thank you.